Tennessee Technological University, popularly known as Tennessee Tech, is an accredited public university located in Cookville, Tennessee, United States, a city approximately 80 miles kilometers east of Nashville. It was formerly known as Tennessee Polytechnic Institute 1915, and before that as University of Dixie, the name under which it was founded as a private institution in 1909. Tennessee Tech places special emphasis on undergraduate education in fields related to engineering and technology, although degrees in education, liberal arts, agriculture, nursing, and other fields of study can be pursued as well. Additionally, there are graduate offerings in engineering, education, business, and the liberal arts. Affiliated with the Tennessee Board of Regents, the university is governed by a board of trustees. Its athletic teams compete in the Ohio Valley Conference. As of the 2018 fall semester, Tennessee Tech enrolls more than 10,000 students, 9,006 undergraduate and 1,180 graduate students, and its campus has 87 buildings on 235 acres, 95 hectares, centered along Dixie Avenue in northern Cookville. The average class size is 26 students, and the student to faculty ratio is 18 to 1. Fewer than 1% of all classes are taught by teaching assistants, with the rest of the classes being taught by professors. The ethnic breakdown of the student population is, 84% white, Caucasian, 4% African American, 3% Hispanic, 2% Asian, Pacific Islander, 4% non-resident alien, and 4% other. History Tennessee Tech is rooted in the University of Dixie, popularly known as Dixie College, which was chartered in 1909 and began operations in 1912. It struggled with funding and enrollment, however, and the campus was deeded to local governments. In 1915, the state government assumed control of the campus and chartered the new school as Tennessee Polytechnic Institute. The new school included just 13 faculty members and 19 students during the 1916-17 academic year and consisted of just 18 acres of undeveloped land with one administrative building and two student dorms. Due to the rural nature of the school, students also worked in the school garden to grow and prepare their own meals. In 1929, the first class graduated with four-year bachelor's degrees. Tennessee Polytechnic Institute was elevated to university status in 1965, when its name changed to Tennessee Technological University. <laughs> <laughs> Buildings on campus Educational or administrative Rodin University Center RUC, often simply called the UC. Built in 1971 and named for Arliss Rodin, president of the university from 1974 to 1985, this building houses the Campus Information Center Campus Compass, administrative offices for the offices of financial aid, disabilities, communications and marketing, and Eagle Card. It also contains the university's bookstore, the women's center, post office, and primary dining areas. The Joan Derryberry Art Gallery and the university's student-run radio station, WTTU, are also located here. Barchu Hall Bart houses the College of Education's Curriculum and Instruction Department, and much of its activity centers around Smart Classrooms and the Learning Resources Center. It is also the home of the Horace M. Jeffers 21st Century Production and Teaching Laboratories. Constructed in 1916 as the men's dormitory for Tennessee Polytechnic Institute, this building was originally known simply as West Hall. It was later home to the university's biology department and is named for Dor R. Barchu, a former head of the biology department. Barchu is undergoing renovations as of July 2018. Brown Hall BRWN is home to the mechanical, electrical, and computer engineering departments and the Center for Manufacturing Research. About 20 labs are located in the building for research related to these fields. It also features the Denso Mechanical Engineering Smart Classroom. Situated on the southern side of the engineering quad, this building is named for James Say Brown, former chairperson of the Department of Mechanical Engineering. Brunner Hall is home to the mathematics, physics, and computer science departments. 
Situated on the northern side of the engineering quad, this building is named for Clarence V. Bruner, Dean of Faculty from 1961 to 1963. Bryan Fine Arts Building BFA is home to the College of Fine Arts as well as the Wattenbarger Auditorium. Constructed in 1981, this building is named for Charles Faulkner Bryan, head of the Department of Music from 1936 to 1939. Artwork by faculty and students is exhibited in the building, and several instruments from the Charles F. Bryan Folk Instrument Collection, including numerous Appalachian dulcimers, are on display in the lobby. Clement Hall Clem is home to the College of Engineering and the Department of Basic Engineering. The building is also home to the D.W. Matson Computer Center, which includes the administrative offices and data center of the Information Technology Services Department. Situated on the eastern side of the engineering quad, Clement Hall was constructed in the mid-1960s and is named for Frank G. Clement, former governor of Tennessee 1953 1963–1967. -1963 the computer center is named for Dale W. Matson, the engineering professor who acquired the university's first computer, an IBM 650, in the 1960s. Derryberry Hall DBRY is the signature building on campus. It is home to the offices of the President and Provost as well as the offices of Admissions, the Bursar, Records and Registration, Institutional Research, University Development, University Advancement, Graduate Studies, and International Affairs. The building is also the home to the university's main auditorium, Derryberry Auditorium. The oldest building on campus, Derryberry was constructed in 1912 for the university's predecessor, Dixie College, though it has undergone numerous renovations since then. It is named after Everett Derryberry, president of the university from 1940 to 1974. The building's iconic colonial-style clock tower is equipped with a carillon that chimes every quarter hour and plays selected pieces at 5 p.m. and 10 p.m. daily. Foundation Hall FNDH is the location of the University Police, the Small Business Development Center, and the College of Fine Arts Art Education Program. The building was formerly the home of Prescott Middle School. The non-profit TTU Foundation purchased the building from Putnam County in 2009. Foster Hall FOST is home to the Department of Chemistry. Constructed in 1964, the building is named for Dr. Ferris U. Foster, a former department chairperson. As of July 2018, the university is in the process of constructing a new laboratory sciences building, which will house the chemistry department when complete. Foundry FDRY is used by the Manufacturing and Engineering Technology Department for metal casting. Henderson Hall is home to the College of Arts and Sciences, the General Curriculum Program, and the English and History Departments. Constructed in 1931, the building is named in honor of James Manson Henderson, the first director of the university's School of Engineering. Henderson Hall is listed on the National Register of Historic Places, primarily for its architecture. The building was designed by Benjamin F. Hunt, who worked for the firm of noted regional architect R. H. Hunt. Jerry Whitson Hall JWB, or Jerry Whitson Memorial Building, is the home of the university's enrollment operations, including undergraduate admissions, financial aid, scholarships, records and registration, new student and family programs, the graduation office, and military and veterans affairs. The building also houses the back door playhouse, the campus theater, on its lower level. Named for a founder of Dixie College, this building was constructed in 1949 and served as the university's library until 1989. Johnson Hall John is home to the College of Business and its associated academic departments accounting and business law, economics, finance, and marketing, decision sciences and management, and MBA studies. Constructed in 1970, the building is named after Lewis Johnson, the first dean of the College of Business. Johnson Hall includes the 150-seat Don Irvin Auditorium and the Heidke Trading Room. Cottrell Hall Kit is home to the Department of Earth Sciences. This building was constructed in 1916 as a women's dormitory for Tennessee Polytechnic Institute Barchu Hall, on the opposite side of the quad, was the men's dorm. Originally known simply as East Hall, the building was renamed for Tom William Cottrell, the university's bursar from 1918 to 1967. Cottrell Hall is nicknamed Rock Lodge for the numerous rocks and geologic formations on display in and around the building. 
Cottrell Hall is undergoing renovations as of July 2018. Lewis Hall Luz is home to the Department of Manufacturing and Engineering Technology. Constructed in 1920 as an engineering and industrial arts shop, the building is named after William H. Lewis, former chairperson of the university's Department of Industrial Arts. The building is equipped with several instructional laboratories, including the Rapid Prototyping Laboratory. Matthews Daniel Hall Matt Danel is two connected buildings with one name. Matthews is home to the Tennessee Alcohol Safety Education Program, some faculty offices of the Department of Curriculum and Instruction, some faculty offices for the Department of Counseling and Psychology, Academic Development, the Center for Assessment and Improvement, and some psychology laboratories. Daniel is the location of the Department of Sociology and Philosophy and the Criminal Justice Program. The building is named for Charles D. Daniel, the university's first dean, and his wife, Mary Matthews Daniel. Memorial Gym MGYM is home to the Department of Exercise Science, Physical Education and Wellness. The building includes a large gymnasium with a basketball court, two smaller intramural gymnasia, handball courts, and a swimming pool along with offices, classrooms, and apparatus rooms. Oakley Hall, formerly South Hall South, is home to the School of Agriculture, the School of Human Ecology, and the Department of Foreign Languages. The building was constructed in 1931 for the school's Home Economics Department and was renovated in the early 1950s. Oakley Hall is home to the Friday Café, which serves meals prepared by human ecology students and faculty. It was renamed in 2015 in honor of Millard and J.J. Oakley. Old Maintenance Building OLDM is occupied by construction contractors and serves as the headquarters for the construction of the new Laboratory Sciences Building. Pennebaker Hall Penn is home to the Department of Biology and the Cooperative Fisheries Unit. Constructed in 1968, the building is named in honor of Gordon B. Pennebaker, former chairperson of the department. The Paul Hollister Herbarium, located within the building, contains over 10,000 pressed plant specimens. Behind the building is a greenhouse and garden area used by biology faculty and students for academic research. Birds, snakes and other wildlife are on display on the third floor. Prescott Hall PRSC is home to the Civil and Environmental Engineering and Chemical Engineering Departments as well as the Center for Energy Systems Research and the Center for the Management, Utilization, and Protection of Water Resources. Situated on the western side of the engineering quad, this building was constructed in the 1960s and is named in for Wallace S. Prescott, a longtime university faculty member and administrator who served as president of TTU from 1985 to 1987. Ray Morris Hall RMH is home to the Millard Oakley STEM Center, which coordinates the university's STEM outreach programs. The STEM Center opened in 2010. The building and the STEM Center are both named in honor of businessmen who provided funding for the center's establishment. Robert and Gloria Bell Hall Bell is home to the Whitson Hester School of Nursing and the J.J. Oakley Campus Health Services Unit. Constructed in 2008, the building is named for Robert Bell, the university's president from 2000 to 2012, and his wife, Gloria. The building is equipped with a 60-station computer lab and patient care labs that simulate hospital settings. The building was constructed on the site of Smith Quad, a complex of dormitories demolished in the early 2000s. Southwest Hall SWH houses the College of Interdisciplinary Studies and its three schools as well as the Child Development Lab. Formerly the Upper Cumberland Regional Health Facility, the university acquired this building in 2011. T.J. Farr Building Farr, home to the College of Education, the Department of Counseling and Psychology, and the university's honors program. The building is named for the former chairperson of the English and Education Departments. Angelo and Jeanette Volpe Library and Media Center LIBR, the university's library. The library's main floor consists of a learning commons including a coffee shop, and the third floor contains the library's stacks. The library also houses Tex iCube, iMakerspace, and Tutoring Center. Constructed in 1989, the library is named for Angelo Volpe, who served as the university's president from 1987 to 2000, and his wife, Jeanette. Special collections include the donated papers of Joe L. Evans, Democratic U.S. Representative. 
Tennessee Tech also holds documents on the history of the Upper Cumberland region, which includes manuscripts, photographs, and archives. Residential buildings Traditional halls Browning Hall is a men's residence hall located along the western end of Capitol Quad. This building, which shares a breezeway with Evans Hall, was constructed in 1966 and houses the men's living and learning village along with Evans. It is named in honor of Gordon Browning, former governor of Tennessee 1937-1939, 1949-1953. As of July 2018, Browning is undergoing complete renovations. Cooper Hall is a co-ed residence hall located along the southern end of Capitol Quad. Constructed in 1966, this building was named in honor of Prentice Cooper, who served as governor of Tennessee from 1939 to 1945. Cooper Hall shares a breezeway with Dunn Hall. Crawford Hall is a women's residence hall located at the southwestern corner of the main quad. Constructed in 1962, this building contains the Women's Living and Learning Village. It is named in honor of Leonard Crawford, the university's former director of alumni, placement, and field service. Dunn Hall Dunn is a co-ed residence hall located along the southern end of Capitol Quad. Constructed in 1966, the hall is named in honor of Winfield Dunn, former governor of Tennessee 1971 to 1975. It shares a breezeway with Cooper Hall. Ellington Hall e is a co-ed residence hall located along the northern end of Capitol Quad that shares a breezeway in the arts and media living and learning village with Wharf Hall. Constructed in 1971, it is named in honor of Buford Ellington, former governor of Tennessee 1959-1963, 1967-1971. Evans Hall Evan is a men's residence hall located along the western end of Capitol Quad. Constructed in 1966, it is named in honor of Joe L. Evans, who served in Congress from 1947 to 1977. Evans Hall shares a breezeway in the men's living and learning village with Browning Hall. As of July 2018, Evans is undergoing complete renovations. Job Hall Job is a co-ed residence hall for College of Business students, located on the northern side of the Pinkerton Quad. Constructed in 1969, it is named for Elsie Job, the university's former dean of women. The building's eastern end is connected to the northern end of Murphy Hall. M.S. Cooper Hall MSCP is a co-ed residence hall for international students, located along the western side of the Pinkerton Quad. Constructed in 1969, it is named for Maddie Sue Cooper, a former university reference librarian. M.S. Cooper Hall shares a breezeway in the Global Living and Learning Village with Pinkerton Hall. Maddox Hall MDDX is a co-ed residence hall located along the eastern side of Capitol Quad. Constructed in 1966, the building is named in honor of Jared Maddox, a former lieutenant governor of Tennessee. Maddox Hall shares a breezeway in the Engineering Living and Learning Village with McCord Hall. McCord Hall MCRD is a co-ed residence hall located along the eastern side of Capitol Quad. Constructed in 1966, the building is named in honor of Jim Nance McCord, who served as governor of Tennessee from 1945 to 1949. It shares a breezeway in the Engineering Living and Learning Village with Maddox Hall. Murphy Hall is a co-ed residence hall for students enrolled in the Honors Program, located along the eastern side of Pinkerton Quad. Constructed in 1969, it is named in honor of Elizabeth Swallows Murphy, the university's former dean of women. The northern end of Murphy Hall is connected to the eastern end of Job Hall. Pinkerton Hall Pink is a co-ed residence hall located along the western side of Pinkerton Quad. Constructed in 1969, it is named in honor of Herman and Marguerite Pinkerton, longtime university administrators. It shares a breezeway in the Global Living and Learning Village with M.S. Cooper Hall. Wharf Hall Wharf is a co-ed residence hall located along the northern side of Capitol Quad. Constructed in 1971, it is named in honor of Howard Wharf, who served as the Tennessee Commissioner of Education from 1963 to 1971. 
Wharf shares the arts and media living and learning village and a breezeway with Ellington Hall. Topic Suites New Hall North is a co-ed residence hall located along the south side of the Pinkerton Quad. It was constructed in 2010 and houses the Environmental Living and Learning Village. New Hall South News is a co-ed residence hall located adjacent to New Hall North at the southern end of the Pinkerton Quad. It was constructed in 2003 and contains the Service and Leadership Living and Learning Village. Topic. Tech Village Tech Village is a complex of one-bedroom and two-bedroom apartments located on the west side of campus. Topic. Maintenance buildings Facilities – Business Services Building MTNO houses offices and storage space for the Department of Facilities. George and Ridley Car Building Mountains houses shop space for the Department of Facilities. Motor Pool Garage MTNG houses offices and storage space for the Department of Facilities as well as garages for university-owned vehicles. Otis Carroll Building Chill houses the university's chiller plant. University Police Building UPD houses Reserve Officer Training Corps ROTC. The building originally served as the campus infirmary. University Services Building USVC houses the university's heating plant, the Office of Printing Services, and Telecommunications. The building was constructed in 1929. Warehouse WHSE houses offices and storage space for the Department of Facilities. Topic: <laughs> Parks and open spaces. Gerald D. Court's Memorial Arboretum is located in the area between the buildings on the eastern side of the Main Quad and Dixie Avenue. Main Quad is a large grassy lawn surrounded by trees located at the center of the Main Quadrangle. The adjacent road has been designated a greenway and is generally off limits to vehicular traffic. Sherlock Park is a partially wooded park located west of the Engineering Quad. Centennial Plaza is a partially wooded courtyard located south of the Rodin University Center. <laughs> Off-campus units Hyder Burke's Agricultural Pavilion is a 3.5-acre complex located about a mile west of the main campus on Highway 290 Gainsborough Grade. Operated by the School of Agriculture, the pavilion includes a main show arena, sales arena, barn, and picnic shelter. Constructed in the mid-1990s, the pavilion is named for W. Clyde Hyder, a former animal sciences professor, and Tommy Burks, a former state senator. Hyder Burks is also connected to Shipley Farm, in Cookville, Tennessee, and Oakley Farm, in Livingston, Tennessee. Joe L. Evans Appalachian Center for Craft, or Craft Center, is a satellite campus of Tennessee Tech located near Smithville, Tennessee. The 87,000-square-foot facility was constructed in 1979 and is named in honor of Congressman Joe L. Evans the nearby state park is named after Evans's father, Edgar. The Craft Center offers a Bachelor of Fine Arts degree with concentrations in clay, fibers, glass, metals and wood and supports an artist in residence. Academics Departments Tennessee Technological University has a total of 44 bachelor's degree programs and 20 graduate programs as well as doctoral programs in the fields of education, engineering, and environmental sciences. TTU emphasizes a focus in STEM degrees but also provides infrastructure for traditional programs including liberal arts and nursing. College of Agriculture and Human Ecology School of Agriculture School of Human Ecology College of Arts and Sciences Biology Chemistry Communication Counseling and Psychology Earth Sciences 
English Foreign languages General education History Mathematics Physics Pre-professional health sciences Sociology and political science Women and gender studies minor only College of business Accounting Business management Business and information technology Business intelligence and analytics General management Human resource management Production and operations management Economics Finance Marketing College of Education Counseling and Psychology Curriculum and Instruction Physical Education College of Engineering Basic Engineering Chemical Engineering Civil and Environmental Engineering Computer Science Electrical and Computer Engineering Manufacturing and Engineering Technology Mechanical Engineering College of Fine Arts Art Music College of Graduate Studies College of Interdisciplinary Studies School of Environmental Studies School of Interdisciplinary Studies School of Professional Studies Whitson Hester School of Nursing Topic. Programs Cooperative Education Educational Technology Distance MBA Honors Military Science Topic Research Centers Center for Energy Systems Research CESR is an interdisciplinary facility dedicated to research in various problems pertaining to energy and infrastructure. The facility pursues research in solar energy, energy storage, smart grid power systems, power electronics, wind energy, distributed power plant performance improvement, cement, concrete, bridge and structure health monitoring, flood flow modeling, advanced communications, and cybersecurity. Center for Manufacturing Research (CMR) is a facility appropriated by the College of Engineering for the research in areas related to manufacturing. It has been designated as a center of excellence by the state of Tennessee. Center for the Management, Utilization and Protection of Water Resources is an interdisciplinary research center that focuses its research on biodiversity, enabling technologies and tools, water security and sustainability, and the water energy food nexus. It has been designated as a center of excellence by the state of Tennessee. Millard Oakley STEM Center for Teaching and Learning in Science, Technology, Engineering, and Mathematics STEM actively promotes and supports quality STEM outreach programs in the Upper Cumberland region and throughout the state of Tennessee. The staff at the center work with tech faculty across several disciplines to offer standards-aligned STEM outreach programs, promote STEM-related activities, and disseminate STEM education resources. Cybersecurity Education, Research, and Outreach Center CEROC aims to integrate university-wide existing activities and initiatives in cybersecurity education, research, and outreach. It has been designated as a National Center of Academic Excellence in Cyber Defense Education through 2021. Tennessee Cooperative Fishery Research Unit TNCFRU works closely with the Center for the Management, Utilization, and Protection of Water Resources to enhance graduate education in fisheries and wildlife sciences and to facilitate research between natural resource agencies and universities on topics of mutual concern. Topic rankings U.S. News & World Report, in Best National University Listings 2017, 2018, one of the top public universities 2002, 2003, 2005, 2006, 2007, 2008, 2009, 2010, 2011, 2012, 2013, 2015, 2016, among top regional universities in the South 2012-2016, graduates leave with the least debt in the South 2011, 
2015 to 2018. College of Engineering is one of the best undergraduate engineering programs rankings. Doctorate 2016, 2017. MBA is one of the best online programs in the country. 2016. Among top 10 universities in the South for veterans. 2015. Money Magazine. Top public college in Tennessee. 18th in public colleges in the South. 2017. Social Mobility Index. Top university in Tennessee for stimulating economic mobility 2017 Brookings Institution Metropolitan Policy Program Top Value Added Public University in Tennessee 2015 Payscale.com Highest return on investment for any public university in Tennessee Students have second highest mid-career salary potential of any public university graduates in Tennessee 2017 Princeton Review Among Best in Southeast 2005 to 2014 2016 2017 GetEducated.com Among Best and Most Affordable AACSB Accredited Online MBA Programs, Top School in Tennessee 2017 GI. Jobs Magazine, Military Friendly 2012-2015 Washington Monthly, Top Ranked Public University in Tennessee 2017 Military Advanced Education and Transition Guide to Colleges and Universities, a Top School for Military and Veteran Friendly Education 2016. Topic. Athletics The Tennessee Tech Athletic Program is a member of the Ohio Valley Conference and competes in the NCAA Division I Football Championship Subdivision. The school's teams are known as the Golden Eagles, the team colors are purple and gold, and the mascot is Awesome Eagle. Topic. Student activities. Topic. Honors societies Alpha Kappa Delta, Sociology Alpha Kappa Psi, Business Alpha Lambda Delta, Freshman Alpha Mu Gamma, Foreign Languages Alpha Psi Omega, Theater Beta Alpha Psi, Accounting, Finance, and Information Systems Beta Beta Beta, Biology Beta Gamma Sigma, Business Chi Epsilon, Civil Engineering Chi Sigma Iota, Counseling Delta Tau Alpha, Agriculture Eta Kappa Nu, Electrical Engineering and Computer Engineering Kappa Delta Pi, Education Kappa Mu Epsilon, Mathematics Kappa Omicron Nu, Human Ecology Mortar Board, Senior Omega Chi Epsilon, Chemical Engineering Omicron Delta Epsilon, Economics Omicron Delta Kappa, Leadership Order of Omega, Greek System Phi Alpha Theta, History Phi Kappa Phi, Scholastic Pi Kappa Delta, Speech and Debate Pi Sigma Alpha, Political Science Pi Tau Sigma, Mechanical Engineering Psi Chi, Psychology Scabbard and Blade, ROTC Sigma Pi Sigma – Physics Sigma Tau Delta – English Sigma Theta Tau – Nursing Society for Collegiate Journalists – Journalism Tau Beta Pi – Engineering Religious organizations Baptist Collegiate Ministries Campus Outreach Canterbury Club Chi Alpha Fellowship of Christian Athletes InterVarsity Christian Fellowship LDS Student Association Newman Campus Ministry Presbyterian Student Association Reformed University Fellowship Secular Student Alliance Servants of Christ University Christian Student Center Wesley Foundation Topic. Fraternities Alpha Gamma Sigma Alpha Phi Alpha Kappa Alpha Order Kappa Sigma Omega Psi Phi Phi Beta Sigma Phi Delta Theta Phi Gamma Delta Pi Kappa Alpha Pi Kappa Phi 
Sigma alpha epsilon Sigma chi Sigma phi epsilon Tau kappa epsilon Topic Sororities Alpha delta pi Delta gamma Delta phi epsilon Kappa delta Phi mu Zeta tau alpha Zeta chi currently inactive Topic Chemistry American Society for Biochemistry and Molecular Biology Undergraduate Affiliates Network Chem Med Club Student Affiliates of the American Chemical Society Engineering American Society of Mechanical Engineers American Institute of Chemical Engineers American Society of Civil Engineers Institute of Transportation Engineers Institute of Electrical and Electronics Engineers Society of Manufacturing Engineers TTU Aviation Society TTU Mini Baja Team Tennessee Tech Motorsports Decision Sciences Association of Information Technology Professionals Topic Notable Faculty Michael Birdwell Professor of History Authority on Alvin York and WWI Greg Danner Professor of Music Composer Michael M. Gunter, Professor of Political Science, Fulbright Lecturer, Authority on the Kurds and the Middle East Joseph Herman, Director of Bands, President of the American Bandmasters Association R. Winston Morris, Professor of Tuba, Innovator in the fields of tuba performance, education, and chamber music Ambreen Siraj, Professor of Computer Science, Director of the Cybersecurity Education, Research and Outreach Center, Founder and Chair of Women in Cybersecurity WICYS. Notable alumni Jared Alonji, Comedian and Musician Blanton L. Spa, Grammy-winning producer Rodney Atkins, country music singer Paul Bailey, Tennessee State Senator Jimmy Bedford, 6th Master Distiller at Jack Daniels Roger K. Crouch, NASA astronaut Trey Crowder, professional comedian Lincoln Davis, former U.S. Congressman Ron Estes, U.S. Congressman from Kansas Rich Froning Jr., four-time CrossFit Games champion L. Wa Grooms, former NFL player Johnny H. Hayes, former TVA director and presidential campaign finance manager Mike Hennigan, former NFL linebacker Dwight Henry, former Tennessee state legislator and gubernatorial candidate Bill Jenkins, former U.S. congressman Kenneth Jernigan, advocate for the blind, former head of the National Federation of the Blind Andy Landers, women's basketball coach at the University of Georgia Adam Liberatore, MLB pitcher for the Los Angeles Dodgers Barbara McConnell, New Jersey State Legislator Kevin Murphy, NBA player for the Utah Jazz Frank Omiale, NFL player Derek Rogers, NFL player Eric Sabel, former MLB player Darren Schoenrick, college baseball coach at Memphis David Simmons, Florida State Senator Ken Sparks, football coach at Carson Newman College Scott Stallings, professional golfer Carl Steiner, former Commander-in-Chief of the United States Special Operations Command Harry Stonecipher, former CEO of Boeing, McDonnell Douglas, and Sunstrand Barry A. Van, author, lecturer Lonnie Warwick, former NFL player Dottie West, country singer Barry Wilmore, NASA astronaut and United States Navy test pilot Jim Youngblood, former American football linebacker in the National Football League for the Los Angeles Rams and Washington Redskins 
Traditions Campus lore Golden Eagle, the statue now atop Derryberry Hall was stolen by three students Tom Moran, Roy Loudermilk, and Lewis Brown from the lawn of the burned-out Monteagle Hotel in Monteagle, Tennessee, in November 1952. The three had hoped the Eagle would provide the ultimate prop for the pep rally prior to the football game against then-rival MTSU. The hotel's owner, John Harden, a former state treasurer, demanded the return of the statue and initially rejected all offers to purchase it. He finally relented and sold the statue for $500 after Governor Frank G. Clement intervened. The eagle, which weighs 70 pounds 32 kilograms and has a 6-foot wing span 1.8 meters, was initially placed atop Jerry Whitson Hall. It was moved to its current position atop Derryberry in 1961. Damn it. The dog, a former university president once said, Damn it. To a dog in front of a crowd, covering by saying that was the dog's name. Damn it has his own tombstone, an operable fire hydrant, on campus opposite Derryberry Hall. T.J. Farr Building is one of the few buildings on campus not called Hall. It is said this is because when you say, Far Hall. In the South, people think you're referring to something other than an academic building, namely a fire hall. The blizzard is a tradition which started in 1984, when students celebrated the first successful shot made by Tennessee Tech in a basketball game against MTSU by throwing showers of Tech Squares toilet paper into the air. Since MTSU moved to the Sun Belt Conference, the blizzard is now performed against Austin P. State University. <laughs> 